how somebody could be your best friend and your companion and your most trusted person in your life and then they could go and become your worst enemy who knows how to hurt you because they were once your tr most trusted person. Once upon a time, in the world of superstars, Kendall Jenner and Selena Gomez seemed like close pals. But behind the glitz and glam, a different story emerged. Taylor Swift spilled the tea on Kendall's not-so-friendly moves towards Selena Gomez. Join us as we explore Kendall's actions that left both singers feeling betrayed. Can you believe there was a time when Kendall and Selena were besties? Well, those days are gone because Taylor finally talked about Kendall's less-than-kind behavior towards Selena, not just once, but multiple times. Let's dive deep into the video, but before that, make sure to subscribe to The Celebrity Fix for future updates. For a while, Kendall had felt envious of Selena's fame and widespread admiration. While Selena dazzled as a multi-talented star in both acting and singing, Kendall struggled to find her own niche and direction. Her journey into the limelight began unexpectedly, riding on the coattails of her sister Kim Kardashian's notorious tape scandal. Kendall eventually found her path in the world of modeling, but lingering whispers remained, people attributing her success to her famous family's name and connections. After an incident where Selena seemingly outshone her, Kendall adopted a pleasant facade when interacting with Selena. However, deep down, she didn't harbor any sympathy and would gladly watch Selena face setbacks in her romantic life. Kendall relished her current position because she believed she finally held some advantage over Selena. This newfound edge was thanks to her close friendship with Justin Bieber. Kendall slightly dropped hints about spending time with Justin or being in the know about his activities, fully aware that it provoked Selena. And Selena, concealing her jealousy, played along, using these moments to glean insights about her ex's life. I think the one that I guess hurts the most is that people think I'm a mean girl, because that's just not the case. It can be upsetting when someone is questioning your character, and if only, like, people knew me. Kendall wants people to believe she's not mean, but actions speak louder. When asked about her least favorite in Taylor's squad, Kendall avoided the question, but when Selena's name popped up, her reaction said it all. Kendall. Who is your least favorite member of Taylor Swift's squad? There's Selena Gomez. In an interview, Selena called Taylor her girl, noting how they learned from each other during tough times. The friendship is real, confirmed when Selena revealed Taylor as her sole industry friend. In a chat about her documentary, Selena admitted struggling to form bonds with fellow stars and her only friend is Taylor Swift. This highlights how tight these celebrities are. Selena's been with Taylor's squad since day one. If you recall the squad era, you might remember Kendall was in it too, but only until 2014. Reportedly, Selena found some flirty messages from Kendall to Justin. Their 2014 split supposedly linked to Kendall and Justin's Paris escapade. Rumors flew when Justin and Kendall did a Vogue photo shoot in April 2015. Fans sensed a close bond. Come November, Bieber hinted at something with Kendall, telling Billboard it wasn't serious. A source stated, Those Instagram photos of Justin and Kendall at Coachella just confirm what Selena thought all along, that Justin was cheating on her with Kendall. And it all started at last year's Coachella. Both Justin and Kendall denied any type of romance at the time, but Selena always had her doubts. It stings. Seeing the recent pictures of Justin and Kendall together is like a stab in the back all over again. It's not that Selena wants to be back with Justin, it's more of a betrayal thing. She feels betrayed by Justin and Kendall. During that year, a Hollywood Life report emerged, revealing that Selena Gomez had stumbled upon a compromising situation involving Kendall Jenner and Bieber. This incident took place after the Coachella Festival. Selena unexpectedly showed up at Bieber's residence only to discover him and Kendall in an intimate situation in bed. This discovery deeply impacted Selena, prompting her to send angry and insulting texts to Kendall over the following months. This reaction was understandable, given Selena's belief in their friendship. The drama escalated when Kendall began dating Harry Styles in 2016, who had his own history with Taylor Swift dating back to 2012. This upset Taylor because Kendall had promised to avoid Styles due to his past connection with Taylor. 
This situation pushed Selena to her limits, leading her to sever ties not only with Kendall, but also with the entire Kardashian-Jenner family. Since then, Kendall and Selena have yet to mend their rift. In 2021, Kendall Jenner celebrated Easter in the same pink floral dress that Selena Gomez had worn in one of her music videos. This dress choice caught fans' attention and sparked discussions. Adding more drama, Kendall retweeted and commented on a cheeky tweet about the dress. Though she later deleted the post, a screenshot captured the incident. The tweet came from a Kendall fan account complimenting her for rocking the dress better than anyone else and mentioning the comparisons to Selena. Kendall shared this tweet on her own account, mentioning that she took the dress home from the set. This move stirred controversy and faced backlash from Selena's fans, leading Kendall to eventually remove it. Nonetheless, Selena's fans noticed the fuss, hinting at an ongoing feud that might not fade away soon. Kendall's reputation for being unkind isn't just limited to Selena, there are more instances. Corey Gamble previously called Kendall out for her rudeness after a fight with her sister Kylie. Let me tell you one thing, just so you understand. Kendall, you've been a rude person since for years, man. You all your ass when you feel like it. You, you get riled up for no reason. You. Corey expressed that Kendall had always been rude and easily provoked. YouTuber Annalise Mischler shared an episode where Kendall was snippy and negative, staying silent while everyone else hung out. And we're all like, talking and hanging out and like playing video games, I think, even, and just like eating goldfish. And she was sitting there on the bed the whole time, not saying a word. If someone asked her a question, if he like talked to her, she would just be like, no. Yeah. Like, just like literally so snippy, so negative, so just rude. In 2014, a waitress claimed that Kendall skipped out on a $60 bill and didn't leave a tip. Supposedly, Kendall even tossed cash at the waitress and laughed when asked to pay. A Brooklyn bar displayed a photo of a receipt with Kendall's signature but no tip amount, prompting the bar to remind patrons to tip. Kendall defended herself, saying she tipped in cash. These aren't the only instances. Kendall's history contains more such incidents, and all these incidents tell that how rude and mean she is to others as well. While being mean to Selena might not have shocked many, Kendall has expressed her frustration with false narratives about her. She told Vogue that what truly upsets her is when people create untrue stories about her. She finds it aggravating when these narratives are built from tiny moments without context. Something that like boils my blood, that like really frustrates me and like I think upsets me the most is when it's someone claiming a false narrative for me. The internet, I guess, bases things off of such small moments yes. with no context. Right. They don't know the before or the after, and they'll take that and run with it and then completely judge you based off of this one little thing. From shared dresses to underlying tensions, their stories paint a complex picture of friendship and rivalry. While Kendall has faced accusations of mean behavior, she also contends that the internet often distorts reality. The real question remains, is there a chance of these two getting back together? What other secrets lie beneath the surface? And what do you think of Taylor and Selena's bond? Share your thoughts in the comments section. For more intriguing insights into celebrity drama and beyond, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, The Celebrity Fix. We'll see you in the next video.